Hello friends, it's Jimbo Rear. Welcome back to Jimbo Rear's Wacky World where we are outside Disneyland's California Adventure for Oogie Boogie Bash on Halloween night. And we're going to go inside and take a look and see what some of the festivities are that's going on inside there. If you are not familiar with Oogie Boogie Bash, it's a Halloween celebration that takes place at Disneyland's California Adventure Park. And it's full of trick-or-treating and a special Halloween parade and cool photo opportunities like this right here with the Headless Horseman statue uh, and lots of unique characters and characters in their Halloween outfits like Mickey here dressed in his Halloween outfit and encounters with Oogie Boogie himself um, and lots of fun photo spots kind of like this here with the Oogie Boogie Bash as well as the Cars Land with the uh, Halloween. I mean, and where else can you see Tomater dressed as a vampire driving down the street <laughs> to go greet people for a photo op? How cute is that, right? Now, I mentioned that there is trick-or-treating, and there's trick-or-treating through the entire park. Here they are handing out some bags, and you will fill up those bags in no time. You get tons and tons and tons of candy at this thing and you basically just walk up and, and get stuff now the cool thing about this is that the candy stops inside look like this i mean there are different themes and you walk in the room and the room's all decorated as some type of theme and there's a villain in there like oogie boogie this is the oogie boogie room where you go in and get your get all your your snacks and candy and stuff like that um and you can get little selfies and photos and things with oogie boogie just like that. Super easy to do. And there are tons and tons of villains. There's villains at every stop. You never know who you're going to encounter. Here's an, another one right here. Um, Hades was there, for example, and he's given all sorts of smart alecky jokes. And when he would get mad, his hair would turn red as well as his entire stage. Awesome, awesome, awesome. This was very cool. Ernest, uh, Ernest de la Cruz from uh, uh, Coco, uh, villain from Coco. He actually does a show and sings Remember Me. And that was awesome. You can watch a video of that on this, uh, on this channel to see some more of that performance. There's Agatha, Madam Mim. It's just very cool that you can go and, uh, and see these cool villains just sort of pop up here in these candy spots and they're out there all night long for you to take pictures of and interact with uh, here's an unusual one there's Sid from Toy Story the the bad kid that destroys and kills all the toys and turns them into monsters and uh, the judge from Roger Rabbit so like I said lots of fun villains to see during your trick-or-treating now of course there are you know regular characters about as well there's Loki. Um, you can see uh, here's Lotso from Toy Story. And, uh, and they're just out kind of wandering around in, in various places. There's the Black Panther who's getting mobbed by people for photos. And, uh, and as you're walking around, you never know who you're going to encounter. Uh, there's Bruno. There's even some very, very rare encounters like this right here. Mickey Mouse in his Kingdom Hearts outfit from the Kingdom Hearts video game. If you're not familiar with that game, it is a combination of um, Final Fantasy and Disney. And there you go, there's Goofy and Mickey in their Kingdom Hearts outfits. The line for that is very, very long though. <laughs> the, the specialty characters are very long. They do a very, very cool Halloween parade with lots of villains in it and you can see on another video on this channel the entire parade that I've put on there for you to watch. These are just a, a couple little highlights to give you an idea. But great characters. It's like all villains all the time in this. It's a little different than, uh, quite different than the Walt Disney World Halloween Parade because this one just primarily focuses on the villains, which I absolutely loved. Uh, there's also uh, a very cool experience there that... I don't. I wasn't exactly sure what it was when I read about it, but it's called the Villains Grove, and it is actually a walkthrough in the woods. This is it right here, and it is 
a, a, a very, uh, gosh, it's an all-encompassing type of um, atmospheric walk through the woods with lighting and sound effects and music that represents all the villains from the, the Disney universe. Um, it's, it's completely immersive. It's just like an immersive art piece. It is amazing, and you definitely need to see that if you're going to Oogie Boogie Bash. But anyway, there's just sort of a, 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 a look at what there is at Oogie Boogie Bash and the fun stuff there. If you've never been and you're a Disney fan and a Disney villain fan, you definitely need to go check out this Halloween party. There you go. That is a look inside Disneyland's Oogie Boogie Bash. Oh, you can hear Oogie Boogie talking right now. <laughs> and some of the festivities that they're having on Halloween night. So I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you have, click that like button to let the powers that be know that you like the video. And while you're at it, click on follow or subscribe. And you'll be notified when I upload new videos. But thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time.